Hey guys, welcome to the next video on shell scripting tutorial for beginners. In the last video, I've shown you how to use while loops in shell scripting. Now, in this video, I want to continue uh, using the while loop and I'm going to show you some of the tricks which you can use with while loop. And the first trick is using sleep with the loops, right? So as you know, uh, this code I have written in the last video and this prints the value 1 to 10 on terminal, right? Now for uh, some reason, I want uh, to give some delay while printing the value. And this I can do with sleep command. So I can just write sleep here and then whatever number I will uh, give here, for example, 1, uh, it's going to uh, pause the execution of this loop for this much amount of seconds and once again executing this loop normally, right? So the sleep command gives a pause of uh, whatever seconds you want, uh, you can write here. So if you want two seconds, you can write two seconds or whatever seconds, right? So let's run the script and let's see what happens now. So run the script and you can see the numbers are printing after a uh, interval of one second and once the condition is met you can see it comes out of the loop and we can see our normal terminal right now if i don't provide this increment the value of n will always be one so for example i remove this uh, increment of n the value of n will always remain one for example and this loop will execute infinitely so let's run the script and let's see what happens now so you can see it's printing one 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 and this condition is always true so this script will run always until you stop executing it right and how to terminate this uh, process which is running using this uh, shell script you can just press ctrl c to come out of this script so control c and i'm out of this script okay so if you want the continuous loop you give a condition such that it's always true right but uh, always remember that uh, you know whatever is the logic of your code uh, if you do not provide this sleep this loop will work infinitely and it will run so fast uh, that it may uh, you know uh, slow your computer even sometimes right so this is the first trick now the second trick I want to show here is how we can uh, open some terminals so for example I want to open three terminals so I will just write instead of 10 3 here and I want to open a terminal using my bash script right so what I can do here is depending upon the what kind of uh, terminal available on your operating system, you can open those terminal. So on my Ubuntu uh, operating system, I have Xterm for example and Genome terminal, which is this terminal. This is the Genome terminal and Xterm is also available on my system. So let's use the Genome terminal command to open those terminal first so I will just use genome minus terminal and just give this and symbol after this right and let me clear the terminal first of all and let me run the script and you will see three more terminals are open so this is the first I will close this the second once again close this and the third I will close this right so using this genome terminal command you can open the normal terminal like this and xterm is available also on my uh, ubuntu operating system so instead of genome i can just write x term and then once again i will run the script and you can see these terminal are open three terminals right so i can close them once again so these are the two tricks I wanted to show you uh, in this video and in the next video we will see how we can read a file using while loop. So stay tuned and please write, comment, subscribe and bye for now.